Hi guys, welcome back to Cooking with Kaden, and today we're making Mexican Eggs Benedict. Mm, it must be really good because it has a 4.63 rating, so... Mm. Ooh, why are they brown? It's chorizo. What's, what's that? Like a Mexican sausage. So we're browning up some chorizo. We're using... It's already brown. Well, we cook it. That's what I mean. When you say brown, it means cook it. So it's um, chorizo chicken sausage. You can use pork if you want. We just use chicken sausage. So we're gonna Ooh. we're gonna cook this it's up. It's a sack. Yeah, we're gonna cook it up, and then we are going to add to it what? What's on the thing here? What then? Oh, cutting board. Ooh, avocados. I'm gonna yeah. pit these. But what's on the? What are we gonna add? Red, to pe red pepper and. Onion. onion and then a little spinach too, but we don't have that. Out I yet. get to pit the avocado. So while this is cooking, we are going to mash up two avocados and Ooh, mash. Get we need a knife. Is this the knife? Eggs ready for. Um, Can I crack the eggs and pit the avocado? Yeah, we're not going to do them at the same time. So avocado first. We're, yep, we're going to get that mashed up in a bowl. I gotta get a bowl down for you. First, we gotta get it cut. And then we'll just squish them up together. What are they going to mix with it? Anything? I think we mix some stuff. I don't know. We can do whatever we want. Oh, Mom, did I do a good job on that? Yikes. A little. It might be a little not. Um... Got it out first try. All right. Let's see. Well, just mashed avocado. That's all. And then you're going to scoop it out of there with a spoon. Here is a spoon. Mom, can you take the sticker off real quick? It doesn't matter. Just cut through it. We're eating the sticker? No, we don't eat the shell of the avocado, do we? Oh, yeah. It doesn't matter. Oh, I made that very uneven. Oh. That's fine. Again, it all goes in a bowl, so it doesn't really matter if it's even. Right? Oh, ever actually, it's pretty even. One's just... A lot bigger than the other. It's fine. I'm just Whoa, Whoa, I sliced it. It's a baby pit. I love when the baby Mom, can get baby I pits. Sliced it. I sliced that out and it is. Careful so you don't cut your hand. Oh, I got a chip off then. You gotta try and hit it right in the middle. There. Twist. That's awesome. I love when we get a baby pit. That means we get more avocado. Right, once this chicken sauce is This almost, one was a huge thing. Yeah. Once it's almost cooked all the way through, we're gonna throw in our veggies and finish cooking it off. So we got stew. Alright, so you wanna tell them we'll be back once we're done getting all this stuff prepped? Yeah. I'm just gonna finish this avocado. Alright. Part of the piece of Okay, this, so that now we're gonna blend and she's gonna drizzle. Alright, we'll tell them what's in there in a minute. Hold it down. You can hold it. You can kind of move it around a little bit. What's the other button for? It's just low. Yeah, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. Keep it flat on the bottom. Chipotle, Chipotle. Powder. you can use powder or, can I try um, it? yeah, you can use Chipotle powder or paste. Is mm. it good? Buttery. Very buttery. 
Salt with the hollandaise sauce. Salt mm. and then lime juice. And then we so we oh, blended it smells like popcorn. We blended everything together except the ghee mm, or butter. It smells like popcorn, it really does. Okay, put it aside because we're gonna do our eggs now. Set our water to boil. You wanna turn that burner around to high? Oh no. Which one? The one over there with that the water one? on it. Uh? Yep. Push in, turn it to light. And now turn it to high. There you go. We're gonna do our uh, egg. Can we do it on camera? Sure, in a minute though, because it's gonna take. A Where second. do we do it? All right, so we are going to put this away. Oh. We have to boil our water. We might as well cover it to make it boil a little faster. You know what? We'll be back once it boils. How's that? Because it might take a few minutes for that to boil. All right. It can't poke the egg. Poke some eggs. So crack it and we're going to put it right into here. So I'm going to swirl the water. And pop it in. Come on. Just drop it in. Woo! Ow! Carefully. Ow, it's burning me. Yeah, you have to kind of do it. Everywhere. Okay, well, do it carefully next time. Instead of up high, do it low and it won't splash. Still probably will. It'll be fine. Yeah, it's boiling. Okay, there, see? My arm and my Okay, hand. you're dripping egg you're everywhere. You're drip egg on Caesar. Ah. Ah, my ah. arm is boiling. Oh, that's hot water. You're going to let this go for four minutes. <laughs> At a time. We're going to do, I'll do two after Isn't this. Isn't it like hard eggs? Or... No, the middle is soft. All right, you can pop those English muffins is down. We've had so poached like, eggs before. It's like hard and... Wait, Mom, are these done? No, we pop them down. Huh? All right. Again? We haven't done it yet. Put your eggshells in the garbage. Right in your face. It. And then get your plates ready. Well, yeah, I did yeah. drop. Drop egg on the seat. And we'll see you next time. No, we won't. We're going to show them how to put it all I'm together. I'm fucking young Kata. Bye. <laughs> Wait, but what about these? What about what? I'm fucking young Kata. I thought we already toasted them. No, we didn't already toast them. You can see push. I have a burn. And you'll be fine. Grab the plates. Put them over here. I thought they were boiling for four minutes. Once these are done boiling, we'll be back and show you how to organize this all. Push muffins on your plates. Nope, they're already done. Pop them up. There you go. One on each plate. Now take some of your guacamole and spread that on. About a quarter of it per, maybe a little bit more if you want. Get more. Okay, then. <laughs> there you go. Okay. And can you pop that show, Jackson? And come on, we gotta hurry up so we can take these eggs out so they don't cook all the way. Alright, and then while you're doing that, I'm gonna put some of this chorizo mixture on top of the guacamole. Some will fall off, it's fine. There's a little extra, which is good because you gotta have some extra meat. Ow, I touched the pan. Spread that down a little bit. And then on top of the meat, we are going to place this really beautiful poached egg. And then take some of your sauce. Here's your sauce. That's Drizz a poached egg. Mm -hmm. Drizzle some sauce on there. Tell me when it's good. Just use a spoon and drizzle it on there. <laughs> uh, on top of the egg, sweetie. Hmm? On top of your egg. I spread it everywhere. Oh, well, that's fine. And the egg goes on top, and then, that's okay, I'll grab it. 
You don't use too much. You want to make sure they're enough for everybody else. There is enough. And then you can sprinkle a little cilantro on top of that. And then that is it, my love. Is that enough? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's too much. This is what it looks like. Woo, my egg! Your egg fell off! No, it didn't. We gotta save it. Save it. It's fine. Oh, it's running. Okay. I wanted to pop it. Well, we'll see you next it. time. Goodbye. You can pop it. You can stop.